Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Dear my students, this is Mr. Faisal Rizdianto. Uh, today I'd like to continue the lesson dealing with phonetics, ya. Yeah? Phonetics. Okay, um, last time I gave you uh, this assignment. Yeah, there are there were two exercises, ya. Yeah? The first is you read aloud and underline the a uh sound in the following sentences. Okay, uh, this is the answer of the question. Yeah, the first is we went to the theater yesterday. Yeah, there are four. Yeah, to the theater yesterday. A uh, jadi semuanya pakai a. Uh, yeah. He can speak Russian and German. So can and then Russian and and German. Yeah, there are four. And then Susan is famous for her Christmas cake. Susan and then famous. Uh, jadi bukan for ya. For, for her Christmas cake. Yeah, there are five. And then... The pronunciation, grammar, and vocabulary are difficult. Yeah, there are seven. The pronunciation and then grammar and vocabulary. Yeah, agak alay, agak lebay sedikit. Vocabulary. Yeah, say with me. Vocabulary. Vocabulary. Jadi bukan vocabulary, tapi v. Vocabulary are difficult. The five, number five, we could ask them if they have reached a decision. Uh, could and then them and then have and then a. Yeah, bukan a, tapi a decision. There are four. A man and a woman were waiting at the station. Yeah, a man, a, uh, and, yeah, and a woman were and then add and D. Yeah. Number seven, they are going to the mountain on Saturday. Yeah. To the mountain and Saturday. Yeah. Well, American English, they say mountain. Yeah. Kalau bilang internet, internet. Internet. Kalau bilang mountain, mountain. There are four. And then number eight, the private sector is all economic activity other than government. Yeah. The private sector and then economic and then other than government. There are seven. Number nine, where are the spoons and forks? Where are the spoons and forks? Yeah. R, D, N, and N. Ada tiga. Yeah. Number ten. There were seven or eight hundred people present at the conference. Yeah. Where are and then hundred, hundred and then at the conference. Ada dua di situ. There are seven. Number six. Uh, ticks the words that contains the uh, uh, yeah, sound. Thursday and then skirt, work, nurse. Yeah. Jadi Thursday, skirt, work, nurse, birthday. Ya, susah bacanya ya. Bukan birthday, bukan birthday, tapi birthday. Birthday. And then turn, weren, and then heard, early. Ya, yang lain-lain tidak bisa dibaca seperti itu. Das, short, Tuesday, year, enggak nyambung dengan sound yang tadi. Okay, uh, then uh, the exercise seven, yeah. Uh, ada dua pilihan, yeah. There are two choices, and then you should find which one which is correct, yeah. Close-nya semacam wilayah. Yeah. Which county, yeah. which country, did you say he live in? Yeah. County itu wilayah kabupaten. Yeah. Jadi county gabungan. Which county? Uh, county and country. County, country. 
she wrap she wrap the silver to make it senior ya yeah. close-nya menggosok ya yeah. kalau rob kalau rap itu menggosok kalau rob itu merampok ya yeah. jadi um, the choice of words deals with the context of the sentences so it is not only the problem of phonetics but also grammatical construction and also the meaning ya yeah. jadi jawabannya rap bukan rob Ya, yang pertama tadi there are a lot of colorful racks 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 and rugs ya yeah. racks and rugs on the floor ya yeah. oke okay. karpet permadani itu yang the second ya yeah. kalau yang pertama racks itu ada kayak ae nya racks kayak dari jembel dari gembel jembel dari miskin jadi kaya raya itu rags to riches ya yeah. it is a story of rags to riches misalnya orang dapat hadiah 1 miliar atau hadiah 5 miliar itu from rags to riches rags dan rags itu lain ya yeah. uh, sajadah itu bahasa inggrisnya praying rags bukan praying rags jadi uh, rags dan rags itu lain ya yeah. jadi jawabannya yang second can i borrow your cup cap ya yeah. cup atau cap ya yeah. nah, boleh saya pinjam topinya kopiahnya ya yeah. kopiah itu cap ya yeah. why you always use your cap ya yeah. when i was in india many non muslim people my friends my classmate in the same batch they ask me why you always use your cap ya yeah. kok kamu pakai kopiah terus ngapain gitu Because I'm a Muslim, saya bilang itu. And ask me everything about Islam. If I know, I can, I will answer it. If I do not, I will ask the others. Jadi, mesti nanyanya, why you always use your cap? Bukan, why you always use your cap? Your cup. Ya, cup itu, ngapain bawa piala, bawa gelas. Oke, okay. jadi jawabnya cap. Number five, we were wondering... We were wondering, we were wondering where she was, ya. Yeah. Ini close-nya imagine atau bertanya-tanya. Jawabannya wondering, ya. Yeah. Jadi roti wonder itu roti yang bertanya-tanya. Gimana rasanya? Wondering, ya. Yeah. Kalau wondering itu berkelana, melancong. Jadi bukan jawabannya. Number six, she has a heart. Heart of gold, ya. Yeah. Heart, heart, ya. Yeah. Heart, jadi hati itu ya heart. Ya, kalau heart itu pizza, hati itu gubuk ya, gubuk pizza, ya. rumah pizza, pizza house, pizza hut ya. Put the batter, put the butter in the fridge ya. Ada batter, ada butter. Kalau butter apa mentega ya. Butter yang pertama adonan, letakkan adonannya di fridge ya di refrigerator atau kulkas jawanya ya did you say he run he run away ya yeah. run in past ten run ya yeah. run yeah. number nine there was a big cut the big cut in the wood ya yeah. kalau potongan berarti cut ya yeah. kalau cut itu uh, kereta yeah. kereta number ten he trip over the stump Stem, ya. Yeah. He trip over the stem and then stem on the ground. Close-nya tunggul pohon, ya. Yeah. Jadi ada pohon yang tumbang itu ada tunggulnya itu but stem, ya. Yeah. Bukan stem. Kalau stem itu wow, perangku ya. Yeah. Stem perangku. Oke. Okay. Uh, until now, until at present, you may differentiate between the difference between words, ya. Yeah. Only one one phoneme will change the meaning. Yeah, it make the difference. So we call it minimal pairs. Yeah, minimal pairs. Jadi ada namanya pasangan minimal. Perbedaan satu bunyi akan membedakan makna. Ya, yeah. seperti bilang doctor and daughter. Ya, yeah. doctor. Uh, he is. Uh, she is my doctor, and she is also my daughter. Ya, dokter itu dokter, dota itu anak perempuan. Ya. 
termasuk bilang beach dan beach ya beach ya, kalau pakai matopi dua kedudukan beach itu pantai kalau beach itu anjing betina atau wanita nakal ya yesterday i went to the beach itu mesti ketawa orang bule itu ya yesterday i went to the beach bukan beach ya malah miso ya oke okay, uh, country 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 wrapped rock rags rock rag rags dan rocks cup dan cap wandering wandering heart Hot, butter, butter. Um, agak mirip-mirip ya. But nanti dicek di kamus ya, di kamus online gimana bunyinya. Ya, run, run. Nah itu apakah sama bunyinya? Nah, yang membedakan itu ada konteksnya. Bisa aja sama bunyinya. Ya, card, cut, stamp, stamp. Oke. Okay. Uh, berikutnya uh, silahkan latihan ya. Jadi misalnya sheet dan sheet nomor satu. Bin dan bin, ya. Kemudian is dan is, ya. Live, life dan live, leak dan leak, ya itu. Nah itu jadi bunyi-bunyi yang seperti itu. Oke, okay, berikutnya ada namanya minimal pairs, ya. Minimal pairs, misalnya desk, this, fun, fan, ya. Di minimal pairs adalah sepasang kata yang bervariasi hanya dengan satu suara. Biasanya berarti suara yang bisa membingungkan pelajar bahasa Inggris seperti F, F dan F dalam fan dan van, ya visa seperti bilang visa, TV, TV, visa, van. Nah, kalau fan itu lain atau the E dan I di desk dan disk, ya. Oke, okay, nah ini silahkan dibuat latihan, nanti saya share materinya, powerpointnya, ya. Misalnya kata cat dan bad, white dan wise, ride dan road, kite dan night, take dan stay, made dan made, ya. Itu bukan minimal pairs. Oke, okay, kemudian tree, tree, thin, moth, nothing, throw, ya. There, breath, weather, although, either. Itu berbeda. Ya. Jadi, tree, thin, moth, nothing, throw. And then, there, breath, weather, although, either. Silahkan dilatih di rumah. ya. Nah, ini PR buat kalian. Ini bacanya seperti apa. ya? In Britain and around the world, the image of the family continues to change. The traditional Victorian family in which the man was the breadwinner, the woman the homemaker, and the children numerous and obedient, is giving way to new ideas about what the modern family should look like. Nah, ini bocorannya, ya. In Britain and around the world, the image of the family continues to change. The traditional Victorian family in which the man was the breadwinner, the woman The woman, the homemaker, and the children, numerous and obedient, is giving way to new ideas about what the modern family should look like. Ya, jadi nanti suatu saat akan saya kasih ujian tengah semester atau akhir semester semacam ini. Ya, jadi seandainya harus membuat yang kode-kode alien seperti ini, ini pas nulisnya gimana? Ya, jadi in Britain and round the world, the image, and I terus Pakai okay, keterampilan tersendiri. Oke, okay, I think it's enough for today. Uh, thanks for your attention. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.